12 we call it the praise we call it the worship so the reason to sustain is the continual revelatory agenda for something strange happens now ladies and gentlemen God is coming on this particular day in the garden just to get what he was used to get every evening but on this particular day things are different because when he comes in the garden he did not find the man where he used to find the man the Bible says uh, when they have the voice of God move in the garden the man was not in his normal spots the man had left the spot uh, and when God called in the garden all the man said was uh, we are naked and we are hiding and God God asked the man who said to you, you are naked. So listen to me, ladies and gentlemen. When you hide from God, you are hiding from the face of God. And hiding from the face of God is hiding from the presence of God. And how did all this begin? All this began when the man opened up to the wrong voices. Life is all about the voices. Where you stand Today there are voices uh, that are always speaking to you. Somebody say the voices. So the woman opens up to the wrong voice and the man is trapped and they eat the fruit and now they are having the consequences of going against the creator just like it is ladies and gentlemen the first time you had issues with your mother is when you disobeyed the instructions on the ground the first time you had issues with your father I know there are people here you don't relate well with your parents. You don't talk to your mother. You don't talk to your father because you disobeyed. Now listen to me. Every time you disobey God, you are going to suffer the consequences. So the man is in the hiding. Why? Because he has disobeyed God. Every disobedience will always send the man out of the spot of the worship. So the man now is hiding. Praise the name of the living God. Now listen to me ladies and gentlemen. When we are talking about the man here we are talking of something that is created in the image and the likeness of God. That's why you look like your father. You look like your mother. There are people when they look at you they say but she looks like the mother. She looks like the father. So you are in the hiding. But there is nothing they can do about your image. They can can say anything they want to say but they cannot undo the image of your father the image of your mother out of your life <laughs> you can run out of block 10 but you still look like your mother you can run out of Rui, but even if you go to America you still look like your father my preaching in this place uh, listen to me ladies and gentlemen the mess you did in the village uh, did not change your face the mess you did in the village did not change how you look like you still look like your mama you still look like your papa the mess cannot undo how you look like that's why they look at you they say she looks like the mother she looks like the father no matter the mess you are in the mistake you are in the image cannot be undone away with so the devil understands he cannot take your image and that's why because he cannot take your image he will make war against the image that's why he says unto Eve if you eat the fruit at the center of the Eden garden your eyes are going to be opened what this the serpent is after the image to mess the image to put that on the image to taint the image and to try and put every manner of things on the image because he understands any dirt on the image is gonna get the image out of the position what took you out of your mama's house was because of the mud that the enemy 
put on the image. What took you out of your father's house was the mud that the enemy put on the image. The truth is there are many people here who are living their lives out of the house. Why? Because the devil cannot have your image, cannot have the likeness, but he can mess with the image. I feel like preaching now. So the man is out of the position, the normal position. Why? Because the enemy has put the mud on the image. And the man says, we are naked and we are hiding. I came in this place today to preach to people who are naked. The truth is there is nothing you are doing in the city. There is nothing you are doing in Ruai. There is nothing you are doing in Nairobi. You are hiding because of the mess you did in the village. And now you are on the runway. But the truth is, you still look like your father. You still look like your mother. But you are hiding. You are out of the place. You are out of the house. Someone say the devil can't have my image. I don't know who I'm preaching to right now. Praise the name of God. Now listen to me. They can't have your face. They cannot have your nose. They cannot have your legs. If you want to know you are so unique, I want you to look at someone who is sitting next to you. Uyo jama meka kando yako. Hakuna venyaneza kuwa wewe. Mapua yako inakaya mama yako. Macho yako inakaya mama yako. No matter what took you out of the house, that thing cannot take your image. You are uniquely made by God. So what the enemy did, he put mud on the image and that's why when you show up they say that is the murderer listen to me ladies and gentlemen they said unto Moses do you want to kill me do you want to kill him do you kill the Egyptian so the devil has a tendency of putting the mud on the image I came in the stadium today to holler unto somebody I don't know what you did I say I don't know the mess you did and now you are on the runway your name is bad they have given you another name than the name you were given I came here to tell you there is war between the seed of a woman and the seed of the serpent and God said the seed of a woman shall crush the seed of the serpent is there anybody in this place all they call you is what you did in your life and with your life there is nobody with the name of prostitute in the kingdom of God umeitwa malaya umeitwa mwizi wa mabwana za watu umeitwa mtu wa madawa that is the way the enemy puts that on your name but I came here to tell you he cannot have your face he cannot have your image he cannot have you you are unique I say you are unique you are not here I say you are unique I don't care how many names they call me but they cannot become revivalist I don't care what they are saying against you but they cannot have your image you are still the daughter to your mother no matter what happened between you and your mother that's why you are not looks exactly like the nose of your mother your eyes looks exactly like the eyes of your father I came here to tell you get out of the hiding I say I came here to tell you the shame is over get out of the hiding for the Bible says and God said to the man who told you you are naked you are not naked they can put mud on your image call 
call you all the names, but they cannot have your image. 